Someone is having a good time. <laughs> Sounds like some angry ducks. You're going to have to enhance that in post. I don't know what's going on, but somebody's partying over there. Duck parties. <laughs> Duck and or deer party. <laughs> Deck deal. Perfect. Okay. Mr. Camera Guy, did you hit play? It is playing, yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> Hello, ants. Hello, ants. So, what have you been doing lately? Uh, working. Doing a lot of video editing. Recreational stuff. Some recreational stuff. <laughs> you really don't know how to answer conversation questions. <laughs> I mean, that's what I've been doing lately. <laughs> Playing a lot of Elden Ring. Oh. How far did you get? I'm currently fighting... What was her name? Lenala, Queen of the Moon, or whatever. Lenala? Lunala. <laughs> Lenala, whatever her name is. Either way, she's a... <laughs> Linda? <laughs> Linda, Queen of the Moon. <laughs> <laughs> so she sends out these, like... I don't know if they're crippled or if they just don't have <laughs> legs. They swim on the floor. They swim on the floor. <laughs> and some of them have candles and they just like... <sighs> and it's really annoying because you walk into it I'm and you feel like a moron because it's like, how did you get hit by that? How did you jump into the path of a book? <laughs> <laughs> How did you dodge three books in a row just by jumping at them? No, why, for real. They were... Why did you jump to try and dodge a giant cannonball? <laughs> <laughs> that was pretty funny. So there's a rolling iron ball trap. Classic Indiana Jones style. I made it all the way up to the door at the end. But I knew I, knew I was just like a second too short. And I jumped out of panic and smacked right into the ball. And it knocked me off the edge. And you fell like 30 feet and a crab ate you. It was, <laughs> it was about 30 feet. And then a giant crab came out of nowhere and pinchy pinchy. <laughs> and then my ruins were still up there where the <laughs> iron balls were. <laughs> and the entire time the um, King Baba, what was it? King Baba. That Mario 64, the Bobum, the first. What the f we'll call it. Anyway, that theme song was playing. <laughs> we don't want to get copyright. It's too good. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta make it sound as crap as we can. Yeah. I've been playing a lot of Animal Crossing. Yeah, me too. I have two stars, down from five. Oh yeah, because you took all your flowers. <laughs> she wants me to plant more trees, apparently. Trees? And I'm like, just say flowers. Just say... I planted like a hundred bushes and it didn't count. Flowers are kind of like little trees. I'm trying to grow them. It rained last night on my game, so... Maybe I'll have more. You will have more. Trying and failing to redo the landscape and stuff. Can't figure out what I'm doing with that. I'm trying to make like a circus wing, you know? Uh. Like a festival place. Like a... With like circus, carnival, and carnival stuff. Like a bug extermination tent. What? You know how, I don't know if they do it anymore, but back in the day, <laughs> maybe when they, like, would bomb your house if you had roaches. They'd cover the whole house in a big inflatable tent. Oh, yeah, they totally do that these days. Yeah. It depends on how bad you've got it. But they would gas it out. That's Yeah, if you actually call an actual... Case. If you call an actual exterminator, they often do that whenever they're, like, redoing the entire house. Yeah. It's pretty much, like, get you, your food, and all of, like... Whatever is really important to you that you can't, uh, that you would rather not have 
insecticide on because <laughs> you have to clean it off after because they blow it out like thoroughly mm -hmm. every inch of your house gets gassed yeah and don't don't uh you don't go in there while the tent's over it no nope. because then you'll end up like joe dirt mm -hmm. <laughs> eating popcorn in the sink with your oh! clothes off like no 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 because no. he, he was hired ah! insecticide Cause he broke into, he was so hungry because he was homeless and he broke into somebody's house that was being fumigated. It can kill you. It can kill you. <laughs> it can kill you. Don't do that. <laughs> yeah, I guess that's that's the it main, will kill you. That's the main thing to take away from it. It doesn't do what Joe Dirt happened. <laughs> it kills you. You don't just get high, you die. <laughs> yeah, that's why they fumigate that way, is because you're not supposed to go in it because it's dangerous. Yeah. That's why you have to leave. And you have to stay away for like at least a few days and at minimum like an entire week or two. Mm -hmm. You can't go back. And then you have to clean everything. Yeah. Thoroughly. You have to you have to wash everything like you're like really thoroughly clean every surface. That that sounds like a pain in the ass to me. It does. That dog. There's a dog over there on a kayak and they're fishing. Here. <laughs> Just turn the camera. Yeah. <laughs> he's not on the yellow one, he's on the other one. He's looking at me. Mosquitoes! Uh oh, it's that time of day. That time of year. Yeah. Really? That dog? <laughs> I just saw him like. <laughs> Slowly it, come through the perimeter. In the frame. <laughs> but anyway, they cast the line and the dog was like... <laughs> <laughs> like, oh my gosh. Oh! Whoa. <laughs> anyway. We're out in the middle of the woods, by the way. Yeah. On the lake shore. On a trail. On a trail. It's pretty nice. It's like a nature trail for like schools and stuff but you can still walk on it when schools aren't in session yeah it's an education study trail mm -hmm. it's pretty cool yeah they got all kinds of critters and stuff in it very peaceful very cool is that a duck what the f whoa it sounds like a very angry duck i think five nights at freddy's is happening over there i heard something that sounded like a turkey a second ago there might be some <laughs> creatures out there and uh if that was a duck it was very mm, there might be something wrong with that duck. see we're in the south so there's no telling what's out there but anyways <laughs> that duck was like <laughs> <laughs> heard some geese honking a second ago geese honking yeah fish are jumping every now and then it's about seven seven in the evening or so turtles coming out what is that sound there's some scary shit in there. <laughs> <laughs> that was right in my ear. <laughs> oh, and by the way, that's not our trash right here. If you can see it. I've been picking it up because litter bugs. Litter bugs. Yeah. They're pretty bad. Around here, yeah. You're the only one that's been cursing. <laughs> I'm just being natural. <laughs> You're like, I'll cut it. Whatever. Yeah. All right. I'll bleep it. Okay. Hi, Crows. Keep hearing stuff from above us, and I'm like, what? <laughs> Is that you, God? <laughs> Is that you, bird, Jesus? Making sure nothing's about to poop on me. I've Probably only, a good idea. <laughs> I've only been pooped on twice in my life by a bird. Uh, one was when I was five. And I don't remember the other one. Cindy Lauper got poop in her mouth. Ooh. While she was performing, she was singing a song, and her mouth happened to be open as like a pigeon flew overhead and Ew. pooped, and it landed right on her tongue. <laughs> <laughs> Mine was less gross. I was just <laughs> bent over, like playing with some rocks or digging in the dirt or some. Boing. Shit. I just felt this on my back, uh. like right in the middle of my back, and I was like, "Huh?" And then it was warm, and I was like, "Oh no." <laughs> Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Took my shirt off. Yep, big old bird. <laughs>
I've never been pooped on. By a bird. <laughs> <laughs> what? I mean, you got baby poop on you before. You? I mean, I've also been pooped on by me. <laughs> <laughs> like, I have pooped myself before. <laughs> Everybody has. Yeah. Everybody poops. At least once. They made a book about it. <laughs> you know, it was really bad, speaking of poop, when you and I got sick that one time at the same time. We were lucky to have two bathrooms. That way when one of us was vomiting in one of them, one of us could be pooping in the other We were one. lucky to have two. The stomach flu is no joke. <laughs> we had spent some time at a, what was it, a pre-release? Yeah. Pokemon pre-release for the TCG and... The place they were having it was at an old folks home, and I think we caught something, because we grabbed some Taco Bell and went home, and later that night, like, she was feeling sick, and then we dropped our friends off at their house, and I started to feel sick, and then we got home, and it just, all hell broke loose. And, like, everybody else, like, well, not everybody, but, like, um... It wasn't the Taco Bell, because nobody else no. who ate at the Taco Bell that day It got wasn't sick. the Taco Bell. We caught something from that old folks home. But I will say, <laughs> um, what was that burrito? The Beefy Crunch. The Beefy Crunch burrito. Yeah. It ruined your experience with those forever. I couldn't eat those for kinda the longest like, time. Kind of like the, what was it, chicken teriyaki? Sweet onion chicken teriyaki with cucumbers. Mmm. <laughs> Ugh. Is, is it safe to say that all of your food experience has been ruined by barfing? It gets ruined when I throw it up. It gets ruined when you throw it up. Yep. Mine, however, does not. I'm just like, this is nasty coming back up, but I'd eat it again. <laughs> <laughs> I like, you mean after it comes up? No. <laughs> I, I would totally eat an entire pizza, but I don't want it coming back up. <laughs> it sounded like you meant, like, I'd totally eat it again after I barfed it up. <laughs> you can totally just leave that in where it is, I guess. Yeah. I don't care. People take it as you will. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'll eat barf every day. <laughs> Quote me. <laughs> <laughs> don't at me. Do at me. Do at me. Well, do what? Do what? Pokemon. Do what? <laughs> oh, that's a nice breeze. That is nice. Whoa, you can see the moon over there. Hello, moon. I hate your queen, Granola. Oh. <laughs> They're like, what'd you say? Quack. <laughs> okay. Not sure that's a duck. Something's in the woods over there, and it's making some funny maybe, sounds. Maybe it's a boar. I don't know. A boar? <laughs> Might be a deer. I guess deers make weird sounds like that. Oh, yeah, deer do make sounds like that, don't they? They're like, grunt, grunt. Someone is having a good time. <laughs> Sounds like some angry ducks. You're going to have to enhance that in post. I don't know what's going on, but somebody's partying over there. Duck party. <laughs> Duck and or deer party. <laughs> Duck bill.